Bimini's are fairly flimsy, but my God bless, the shade is worth having them. And as you can see, being we're cruising, we've mounted semi-flexible solar panels to the top of ours. And probably gonna upgrade to solid panels on top of ours, because these are aging and fading. They're two years old. But one of the problems you keep adding weight to your Bimini is they're flimsy. And and adding weight to them doesn't make them any stronger. So this makes them susceptible to storm damage, not just hurricanes, but thunderstorms will produce 60, 70, 80 mile an hour winds. And there's a lot of surface area here for them to catch. So we're gonna reinforce ours. We've got these wrap around connections that we bought and they just slide around, clamp to tubing. You put a hex nut in them, tighten them up, and then using a grinder, which we have here, and a thin cutoff wheel. We cut pieces of stainless steel tubing to the correct length, put the eye sockets on them, and they're held on with a set screw that actually indents into the tubing so they don't slip off the end or rotate. And then we're gonna beef this Bimini attachment up because it's only attached at one point down here with a little brace in the back. And they're so wobbly. So let's beef this up a little bit and see how secure we can make it. Now that we've added our braces, we still got a little movement, but as you can see, it's the entire structure moving now all the way back to the dinghy davits because now everything is tied into one unit, which gives this Bimini, instead of just having two points of attachment, four points of attachment. And it reduces the length of this arm bending moment off this brace and ties everything together and makes it stronger. So we're looking forward to surviving many a storm.